Venice is one of those cities that you can just wander around and enjoy the streets, travel on the boats and enjoy the canals. And there is fantastic art. There are often many crowds. But one of the places I'm always surprised that people don't go into is the Church of St. John Grisostomo, because it's on the tourist route from the railway station to St. Mark's Square. It might be because it doesn't look particularly interesting from the outside, but should you wander in, first of all, you'll find a very calm space. The church was designed by one of the great Renaissance architects of Venice, a man called Mauro Corduzzi, in very simple style. So it might not look like much, but it's very calm. And then there are two glorious paintings. On your right as you go in, a painting by Giovanni Bellini, which shows three saints. It's a rather unusual format. On the left, you have St. Christopher. His name means the bearer of Christ. He was a ferryman across a river and he carried Christ on his shoulders. Now in Venice, where people were crossing water all the time, he was a hugely important saint. The high altarpiece was painted by a man called Sebastiano del Piombo. And again, it's somewhat unusual in its format. In the center, in profile, rather than looking towards us, is a man in red. That is St. John Chrysostom, the patron saint of the church, surrounded by three other saints, two of whom are also called John. Whereas on the left, a group of female saints gather, nevertheless, with the rich Venetian colors and the soft edges, it becomes very harmonious and very balanced. And look at the floor in the painting, the square red and white tiles. It's the same tiling as you see in the floor of the church itself. It ties it all together. It makes it look as if the saints are in the church there with you. I'm Richard Stemp and this is London Art Studies.